Hello everyone, my name is Edward King and at, at time of recording, this is all, almost half past fucking 12, so half past fucking midnight here, here in the UK, but I had to, I had, I had to, I had to say something. So I watched a video about how certain develop, game developers over on Shitter, I mean Twitter, bashing Game, bashing gamers because of what Bioware atten intends to do with the Mass Effect Legendary Edition. For those of you who, who are living under a rock, the, ma ma the Mass Effect Legendary Edition is supposed to be a remaster. All three games in one, one edition but with updated updated gra graphics and, performa and performance. Right? That's what it's supposed to be, but apparently Bioware is going to censor the fucking game, and that that's why and that's why gamers are so fucking pissed off because in, you're not supposed to censor a an old like old fucking game for modern times, which is code for woke bullshit, and so. With that context, apparently on Shitter, uh, Twitter, game developers basically just just attacking attacking gamers for being upset about this. So, and I know the perfect tit title for this fucking video. This is a special message to every single fucking video game developer who bashes their players and their fans all right so if you if you don't want to hear this you have five fucking seconds to get the fuck out all right five, five seconds over so the pussies are fucking gone right you game developers who the fuck do you think you are just because you develop the game doesn't mean that you have absolutely fucking authority to make fun of your players or fans or even gamers in fucking general. Because listen here, you you fucking stuck up piles of fucking shit. If it wasn't for gamers, you wouldn't have your fucking jobs. Now would you? So the way that I fucking see it, you you work for us just like you know the the fucking method of ca capitalism you make a product we buy it right if the if the product is good we would recommend it to more players which would make you more money so therefore you are kind of pretty much indebted to your customers so why in ever loving fuck would you say to gamers ha you're all incels go fuck yourself we don't need you you know all that bullshit that is like a pretty fucking red flag to your own fucking me mental fucking state that you are a narcissistic no narcissistic cunt which do not, and I repeat, do not even fucking deserve to be a fucking game developer. Oh, I wanted to make something beautiful to play to play as. Ah, you're all in, you're all fuckwads and all that shit. That's the kind of person you fucking are. Now, to good game developers who don't do this shit, speak up in in defense for fuck's sake. Oh, jeebus. I am so fucking sick and fucking tired of video, video game developers. You're nothing fucking special. I'm sick and fucking tired of them looking down on fucking gamers when they should look up to fucking gamers because it's us. It's us who play their fucking game, it's us who buys the fucking game and it's and it's fucking gamers who actually play the game on fucking stream 
so that more people would see would see this and possibly fucking buy the game. But no. Oh, we may. Oh, we may made, made the game. So blah blah blah. Shut the fuck up. That's all you need to do is zip this. You know, zip it. Shut the fuck up. And make good fucking video games. Because if you don't, look at what look at what's ha happening to your precious Last of Us Part Two. It's being shit on by every fucker. Even the voice actors are coming out and saying, "Yeah, it's a pretty shit game." <laughs> Uh, and that's what, and that's what, but by ways pa pandering to, by ways pa pandering to the fucking pearl cl clutching. I was like, oh, you cannot look look at a female's butt, even though in the same fucking game they have a topless man in there, and it's like, oh yes, more of that, please. Oh, six pack, yes, thank you. You looking at a female's butt? Nah, male gaze, toxic. Fuck you. Seriously, fuck you if you ever fucking think that. Seriously. I am sick and fucking tired of it. And I think that I believe 99% of all fucking gamers are sick and tired of this. How many fucking years have we, have we had this? So I think it's about time that Gamers actually think with their wallet for fucking once. That's the only way that you have the power over game developers. Is to not buy their fucking shit if they talk down to gamers. <sighs> but... Gamers ain't gonna listen. Because... I don't know why. But again... This is just a simple fucking message to the game developers who think that oh just because you create you create the fucking game gives you absolutely fucking authority nah no it doesn't it just means that you put your ideas out there and us as gamers we have a chance to look at what you make what you have made and see if it's any good or not. A lot of the times, people are just gonna hate on it. You know, hate. You know the old saying, "Haters gotta hate." But some gamers actually do have valid fucking criticisms, and those are the fucking people that you should listen to. Hell, I was just gonna do a ra rant fucking video, but it's sort of a it's sort of a half and half right now. So that's what I, I got got to fucking say about this topic now is anyone going to listen to the viewpoints that i have uh, that i have brought up that gamers need to vote with their wallet if we say to the developers we don't like what you are doing we don't like your game we're not going to fucking buy it and for the and for the game developers who talk down to their fucking players, this should be a giant fucking middle finger to you, and saying you don't control us, we control you. We have the power to make your game succeed or fail. And it's and I think now is. About fucking time that gamers thought that way. Is that if we don't think your product is good, then we will not buy it. But anyway, that, that's what, like I said, that's all I gotta say for, for the matter. If you enjoyed me swearing a whole fucking lot, give me one of these. If not, eh, thank you for your time anyway. Let me know in the comments down below if you're sick and fucking tired of this uh, of modern times invading every single fucking aspect of life now. You know, if you're sick and tired of that, let me fucking know because I am. I'm sick and tired of this. Make good fucking products. 
We see it in TV. We see it in movies. For fuck's sake. And we've, and we've been seeing it in video games for fucking years. It doesn't fucking work. Stop doing it and make good fucking video games for the love of all that is fucking good because if they if the if the video game industry does not wake up then the video game industry will die i don't want that to happen playing video games is my favorite fucking hobby it's an expensive one but what are you gonna do so yeah I'm just gonna end. I'm just gonna end it here. So, uh, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.